Here's my checklist. I have to act cool. I have to act like I don't care. I have to act like nothing bothers me, even if it does bother me. I have to act like I don't want my twin flame. I have to act like I'm mad at my twin flame. I have to act like everything is perfect. I have to act like my journey is going great, even if it isn't. I have to feel amazing, always. Even if I feel horrible, everything is amazing. My journey is amazing. I have to send love. Send them love. Constantly send them love. Always be sending them love. Never not sending them love. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I have to say that 37,000 times a day. I have to stare at the clock for it to be 11.11 11, and then light a piece of my hair on fire and dance in a circle counterclockwise. What you really need to do is stop sensationalizing this twin flame journey. True love is natural. Being with your twin flame is the most natural thing on earth. You were created to be together. You were created as one. It is very natural to be in union. So there's no need for the humongous, over-the-top expression of love like you might see in a movie. You're feeling like you have to do this huge act of love to get your twin's attention. I mean, that's really nice, but are you going to do that every time? Like they come out of the shower and you have like fireworks and confetti and like coming down and this 20 piece band playing in the background, you know? How realistic is that? Each time you have to do something else to like top the time before that. How exhausting is that? Love isn't exhausting. So just love naturally. Be yourself. That is the most attractive version of you. Drop all the rules and what you think people want you to be or look like or act like or sound like. And be who you really are in your heart. Be who makes you feel good about being. Act as if it makes you feel good to act. Sound how it feels good for you to, to express yourself. Embrace who you really are in your heart. If like you're a nerd, it feels good to do nerdy things, then be a nerd. So what? You know, your twin already loves you for you. They don't want a different version of you. That's not how you were created. They want the real you because that is who they recognize at your core. So understand that you were made a certain way. Doing the mirror exercise and releasing your false beliefs, your upsets, your blocks only makes you realize more and more who you really are. Your goal isn't to become something you aren't. Your goal is to realize who you really are. That is what attracts your twin flame. Not being someone you aren't because that's what you think they want you to be. You're working to be the, the version of yourself that makes you happy and fills your heart with joy is exactly what and who you will attract into your life. When you become a more and more authentic version of yourself, everything that is for you will manifest into your life. That is your twin flame, your perfect career, the friends and relationships that are perfect for you, etc., etc. All of that 
will be attracted into your life as you realize who you really are at your core, your authentic self. Right? This is an inner journey you are on. Self-realization equals focusing on you. So check out the links below or visit asoneguidance.com directly for some very, very juicy, exclusive offers to working through separation and into your harmonious union with your twin flame.